up? It's me, Tima, and I'm back with a new video. And I basically have a huge, huge, huge clothing haul for you guys today. Um, this video is sponsored by Loop Sona. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right. It might be Loop Sona or Lup Sona. Not really sure. I kind of wanted to work with them this time and kind of see if all of the Instagram trendy clothes are worth it or worth the hype. Who knows? I got a lot of stuff, so it's a pretty huge haul. So you guys will definitely have to sit tight. Also, I have my tree in the back. Um, I know it's not Christmas yet, but it's coming really soon. So we went ahead and we put it up a while ago. Okay, so let's get on with this clothing haul. I hope that you guys like it. I'm gonna put the prices to each piece on the screen and down below for you guys. Also, all the link to all the clothing. Let's get started and see if all these clothes are worth the hype. And uh, yeah, bye guys. Okay, so the first piece we're going to start off with is this, to me it's more of like a summer dress. It has kind of like a really thin sweater material to it and the buttons go all the way down the dress, which looks really, really cute. I think I got this in a size medium or small, but I would go a size down for this dress because it does stretch a lot. And the top part is kind of big for me, but it's still workable, I can still wear it. Um, I might wear a different type of bra with this because um, the rest of it fits really nice though. It honestly is pretty cute. Okay, yeah, so this dress is $18.99. It's around $20. In my opinion, the material is kind of thin. I got this in a yellow. They do also have this in black as well, but I feel like to me, this should be like $14 instead of 20. It's pretty cute, but I'm not sure if I would pay $20 for it, if that makes sense. I should have gotten extra small on this, but this is fine. I didn't know what my size would be like. So yeah, pretty cute, $18.99. It's just like a yellow um, slim fitting dress. Also, I paired it together with my matching yellow shoes that I got from Nasty Al this year. And they're super cute. They definitely coordinate really well together. I also paired it together with my denim white jacket that I got from Forever 21 a while ago. All right, and so for the second outfit, I have to say that this is my favorite one. I would definitely go a size up with this skirt though. For me, I think a size large would have been the best. Even though I still have to put a belt on it, it would have fit my hips a lot better just because the material is more, I don't know if this is latex or not, but it looks like latex material. I would definitely pair this together with a checkered um, blouse, something that's like white and black. I would personally prefer to wear that with this just because I feel like red and checkered prints are in right now. Um, together, but I will be getting one soon. So I'll definitely be pairing this up with that for a lookbook Okay, and so this skirt will run you around $25.99 and I just checked and it only goes up to a size medium So this website I can see already that it doesn't go very large I would definitely look into it and look at your measurements and make sure that this would fit you before you go ahead and buy it But I think that this is super cute. It's really trendy and the zippers actually do open up so you can put your hands within the pocket. Never had a material like this um, in a skirt form, so this is a new thing for me. Also has lining underneath the skirt, which I was kind of scared about. I was like, this is gonna be a really cheap skirt that I'm not gonna like, but I do give them points for putting in um, lined fabric on the inside. And so it just feels really nice to put on. Um, together, I kind of just paired that with a black bra and my mesh top that I got from H&M for about a few dollars. Next thing I got, which you guys will be seeing in all the outfits in this video, were my netted tights that I got from Lipsona. Yeah, so these were around $10. I got the mid whole size. So there's a small, a mid, and then a large. Fits me perfectly and I feel like it's a really good staple to have into your closet just to fit with a lot of your jeans or your skirts and stuff like that and it adds a really nice accessory to your outfit. I also got this checkered skirt. It's so cute. I love how it's got the little ring for the zipper. It pulls down pretty easily. This one fits me really well. It kind of fits me like a glove. I did get this in a size medium and it's really stretchy. So it fits extremely well. The way they've made the skirt is pretty nice. Okay, so this checkerboard print skirt is $18.99. Same as the dress. I think it's super cute. Look at how these two look together. If this was like a shirt or something with this skirt, it would be perfect. The orange top that I got from Forever 21 that says dazed on it. 
And it's really cute. I think it goes really well together. It's a nice um, burnt orange color with the checkered print and it stands out really well. All right, so next piece that I actually got was this bodysuit. And it has kind of like a corset detailing in the front. It doesn't really cinch you in or anything, but it has the illusion that it is. And I got this in a size small, um, so it's pretty stretchy. Of course, it's thin. Um, and again, it has like the little buttons on the bottom to snap together. Once you snap them together, you can just pull it up over your legs and it's really easy to put on. Love how stretchable this is. Love the material, I think it's really cute. Okay, so this bodysuit will run you around $14.99, which I think is more worth it than the other pieces. It's not too expensive, really stretchy, really easy to put on. I feel like it's a nice basic piece to have in your closet. And I also paired it together with my high-waisted shorts that I got from H&M. It's more of like a dark denim color. A green army looking color jacket, kind of oversized for me, and I like it that way in my opinion. It just really looks nice with this piece. Next piece that I got was this oversized black checkered hoodie. It's super cute and really trendy right now. And I love how it fits like a dress and it's not too short on me. Usually whenever I get an oversized hoodie, it's kind of too short. I can't really wear it by itself. I have to wear it with shorts or something. This works really well with my thigh high boots. Looks super cute. This runs you around $23.99, which isn't terrible because there is a lot of fabric in this. Not a super thick material, but it doesn't feel like it's cheap or anything. So this to me is actually really nice and I love how it has pockets as well. They have this in white and black. I drop stuff all over my clothes all the time. I will either have makeup on my white blouse or dress or I'm gonna get food on it and that's not okay. I wore it again with my thigh high boots that you see here. I got these from Santee Alley for like $20 so they're super cheap. Okay, next thing I have would be these high-waisted jeans. I was curious to see if this was a trend on Instagram, but this is what the butt is looking like. So it's got a zipper that goes all the way down. I kind of got this for myself as like a gag gift. I'm not really sure if I'm gonna wear these, honestly. Like, I don't think I would wear these seriously outside unless I'm wearing like something to cover up the zipper because I don't want anyone getting the wrong idea. It's kind of inappropriate, but um, it does have that and I wasn't sure. You guys let me know if this is a trend on Instagram or anything. I would love to know what you think about this, but I thought it was kind of bizarre that it had a zipper in the back and they're high-waisted, of course, as you can see. And it's got like a normal zipper in the front, um, but the back does have the back zipper. I also cut holes in this, which I will be fraying really soon. They didn't look as distressed as I would like them to be, um, the ends are also frayed to begin with, so I ended up rolling them up just because I like my pants to be um, shorter for me personally, because I'm pretty short, I'm not that tall. I'm 5'3". I pair them together with my mesh tights, and I think it pulls the entire look together. Also, these pants will run you around $25.99. They're stretchy, they fit really well, and they're, I got these in a size extra large for me. So they, again, they run really small, the pants. So all the sizing for everything is pretty different. Definitely take your measurements for pants because those are always really hard to fit, especially if you're buying them online. Also, I paired it together with this babe um, orange top. This is actually a bodysuit and yeah, it's really, really cute. It fits really well. I got this in a size small also. I love the orange color. I've been really into orange lately. I cannot get away from it. It's super cute. They do come in black and white, but again, I prefer the orange color. Um, the price for this is actually $16.99, which to me is kind of a standard for a bodysuit. It is not a bad price at all. And I love how it's long sleeve and just how it's form fitting on me. It looks really, really cute. And I paired it together with those jeans. I had also paired this together with this super cute skirt, you guys. So this to me fits more of like a dress, but it doesn't go all the way up. It kind of has wiring to where it hits you right under your boobs. I got this in a size medium. The zipper goes all the way down and I haven't seen a skirt like this ever, to be honest. So I was like, I have to get it. It looks really different. It runs around $18.99, which I think is not bad for this skirt by any means. 
because it really does help to cinch in your waist and I just haven't seen anything like it before. It has an underwire underneath so it lifts your boobs up a little bit, kind of gives you a nice little lift. And it looks really cute. I feel like this is like half dress, half skirt. It only comes in black and this is again in the size medium. I don't wanna wear it with like a t-shirt or something. I think it would look really cute with boots for the winter. Definitely one of my favorite pieces that I've chosen out of this entire collection. Also my last piece that I have is this girl gang shirt. It's like a crop top actually. I love how it's got the elastic bands um, on the arms of the sleeves. I love how it kind of has like a turtleneck thing going on here. But it's stretchy, it's really cute. Um, I got this in a size small. It only comes in the color gray. Pricing for this is $15.99, which to me it's like Forever 21 pricing. It's pretty cheap, it's not that bad by any means at all. And I think it has quite a bit of fabric here, so it looks really cute. And I also paired it together with my jeans that I got from Fashion Nova. I actually thrifted these jeans at Buffalo Exchange. They came brand new with the tag still on it, which was really nice. And I know that you guys saw it in my latest Instagram post and you were saying how much you loved these jeans. It has a really big hole right in the center of each leg. And I paid around $17 for this and originally the pricing was $40 at Fashion Nova. I got these definitely for a steal. They were brand new. Um, they are high-waisted, they fit me just like a glove, and I am hooked onto these things. So I'll definitely be wearing these a lot. And I think it went really perfectly well with this gray top. But um, yeah, that is it actually for this haul. I have so many clothes here, you guys. Thank you to Lipsona for sponsoring this video. Um, the clothes are really, really cute, really trendy. Look forward to seeing them in some lookbooks paired with other pieces. And um, yeah, uh, I will talk to you guys later. Let me know what else you wanna see fashion-wise in the future because it took me a while to get back into making these fashion videos. I definitely have more coming up. I'm gonna put all the links to each piece down below. Also, if you like this video, make sure to subscribe and also to hit the notification bell down below so you won't miss any of my content. I will talk to you guys later and bye.